An Oceanside man accused of setting his house on fire and watching it burn with his wife inside faced a jury today. And we have learned of a possible motive. He was furious over money. New at 530, 10 News reporter Vanessa Van Hefty explains why the man blamed his wife. The couple's home is completely fenced off. Investigators testified today that Andrew Hollis took lighter fluid all around the perimeter of his home, trapping his wife inside. Andrew Hollis still has the scars to his forehead from the fire that killed his wife of 23 years. Cell phone video captured the flames. Investigators say Hollis calmly watched all this as his wife burned, telling neighbors she was out. The judge ordered we not show his face. Diana Hollis's son testified the couple had a volatile marriage and his stepfather had made chilling threats numerous times. And said if he was going to burn his yes. down. Yes. And his refers to the trailer, is that correct? The mobile home, yes. The, mobile home. the son said his mother had loaned him $5,000 and that made Hollis livid. Investigators say Hollis wasn't sad about his wife, at first saying he tried to save her, later admitting that was a lie, his story constantly changing. He had said that he, somebody had come at him with a knife and a torch trying to light him on fire and he admitted that that didn't happen. The mother and grandmother had limited mobility and was discovered fully clothed in the bathtub with the water still running. If convicted, Hollis faces up to 25 years to life in prison. In Oceanside, Vanessa Van Hefty, 10 News. And several of Diana Hollis's children and grandchildren wiped away tears in court today, saying that she wanted out of the marriage, but Hollis wouldn't allow it, saying that he didn't believe in divorce. The judge ruled the case will go to trial.